What I don't understand is, why has he got handles on that thing? He's going to fall off it anyway. <laughs> so why, why has he got, like, safety rope? Oh, careful, he's going to fall off. And to be honest, I wasn't impressed with the whole feat in any way. It's just <laughs> falling. Any idiot can fall. <laughs> broken the record twice if he'd had a trampoline. He'd have oh, and when he jumps out of that thing, there's somebody in there and they push an anvil out after him. <laughs> <laughs> it's a race to the ground. Heston, you must have met some celebrity chefs in your time. Who, oh, who do you think yeah. sexiest? Yeah, loads. Like, you're looking at me, Jimmy? Or... No, Heston. Uh, <laughs> I did say Heston at the beginning. Why of that. are you looking at me, then? Well, because you just said, are you looking at me? Was it? <laughs> Over there. That seems perfectly natural. Well, why, well I mean, then make your mind up who you're asking the question to. You're asking Heston or me? When I said Heston. Well, there's no point using his name and then looking at me. <laughs> still looking at me. Stop looking at me. <laughs> this is like a up. fight in a pub. You Are you looking you? at me? <laughs> yeah. You're a lot shorter than I remember, Sean. Yeah, what's going on? Why are you sitting like that? Yeah, you're a lot. Where are his hands? Where are his hands? <laughs> I haven't... What are you talking about? I'm shorter. I'm you're ridiculous. shorter than I remember I can, you being. <laughs> well, I'm sorry if you're not happy <laughs> with the height that I've presented to you tonight. I'm sorry. I didn't remember being booked on eight out of ten tallest people. <laughs> I wasn't put on this show for that reason. I was put on this show for some of the opinions I've got on some very, very serious issues. Now, let's you get like on to the questions. <laughs> It's really freaking me out, man. <laughs> a lot of sure, people you're... are uncomfortable because of my height and my arm span. <laughs> so surely someone as short as you shouldn't have big, long arms like this. There you go. Sorry about that. <laughs> are you auditioning for the role of Mr Tickle? <laughs> what? Can I just ask? Go on, ask. What happened with his ex? Uh, John. John's, John's ex. yeah. Uh, she didn't think... exist. <laughs> she didn't exist. <laughs> gave a bit of a problem. Because she wasn't there, and he was buying her things, and she was just air. <laughs> eventually, he got quite cross with her for not really having a body. <laughs> so he finished with her? Yes. He, he went dumped... like this. I think she dumped him. <laughs> <laughs> Sean, have you taken any risks? I read a pop-up book about giraffes once. That was quite dangerous. <laughs> I know why I was never a jockey. <laughs> <laughs> it was the RSPCA, Johnny, stop that. <laughs> <laughs> John's team, what do you think people have been talking about over the last week? Oh, thank God for that. <laughs> do you think I the get pressure so was nervous, on? I thought you were going to ask me first. <laughs> I just you get relax. so nervous in that moment. I go, who's he going to ask first? And you ask John, phew. <laughs> it's, not, it's not Sean and the twins. <laughs> We don't look like twins, we look like finalists in a what's Mika going to look like in 20 years. <laughs> <laughs> if it's your documentary on OCD and you did look annoying. <laughs> I deliberate. saw that show. I thought it was a bit of a mess. Have you been sitting on that joke all summer? Yes. <laughs> 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 Totally worth it. Um... <laughs> Thanks, dude. So <laughs> 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 West Coast said, yeah. totally worth it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, cowabunga, Sean. <laughs> so, Jimmy, uh, most people love being the centre of attention, true or false? Most, I think most people don't like it, do they? Most people don't like it, that's why they've got like us to take that space. <laughs> Would you like well, well, we obviously like to be the centre of attention. Sure. That's why we're sitting here with the lights on us. We're mic'd up. I've got my special shirt on. Jimmy's lost all that fat round his throat. <laughs> <laughs> Would you do it? Nice. No way. I hate spiders. I hate moths. 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 <laughs> moths. It's just a black and white here now. <laughs> It's just a black and white butterfly. <laughs> I got home the other day, right, and I saw this massive moth, right, in my bathroom. You saw a moth in your bathroom? Yeah, right? I needed to have a shower and I was too scared to go in. So what I did is I went in with this You're super... You're too scared? I went into the bathroom, right, with this super strong hairspray. What? <laughs> so I went through, sprayed And you did this the moth. moth's hair? No. <laughs> I sprayed this moth, shut the door, waited for a minute, saw it on the floor, sprayed it, and then literally oh. crucified it like it was just stuck. <laughs> Poor Moth is there. He's blind. He ain't blind. Is he blind? Yes. Now you feel bad, don't you? <laughs> Basically, 
you've gone up to a blind person and just <laughs> sprayed hairspray in their face. I always talk to people with dogs. Because you, if you want to cuddle the dog, you generally have to ask, don't you? It's amazing how much people will talk to you if you throw beer in a dog's face. <laughs> <laughs> well, talk to one of the dogs, you. <laughs> if, it, if you just throw a pint of beer in a dog's face, <laughs> people start talking to you. you say, they can first they say, what are you doing, do? <laughs> And then you say, conversation star. Yeah. <laughs> Back to the chat. Usually, yeah. the, usually the conversation is, I'm blind and now my dog is drunk. Brilliant. <laughs> Oh, you just, I just, I lie, I tell lies. I go to someone and go, I wrote the birdie song. <laughs> not, not all of it, I didn't write all of it. I got stuck on did a little, little. But in a minute, everyone's chatting and you get bored and you throw a beer in a dog's face. <laughs> <laughs> okay, best way to start a conversation in a bar. You buy them a drink. Well, offer to buy a drink is number two. What, what, are, the other, what are the other things are people you say? What's number five? OK, so Tell it's... me number five, Jimmy. <laughs> Ask to borrow a lighter. Can I borrow your lighter? Yeah, not like that, Sean. <laughs> there's loud music playing in the pub. I have to shout. Bloody loud music in here. Can I borrow your lighter? <laughs> I said lighter, you stupid <laughs> What else, Sean, what else have the nation been talking about this week? It's the nut. Ah. Oh. Oh. <laughs> the Tory party conference. Oh, you love it. I was marvelled at the. It just it was brilliant, wasn't it? Did you enjoy it? Oh, the part when I came on. Oh, did you? <laughs> yeah. I didn't see that, so I missed that bit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, fingers on buzzers. Two more to get. Sean. Is it the Jimmy Carr tax scandal? <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a look at the Rolling Stones. I think they look like a great collection of Toby jugs. <laughs> <laughs> I think the most important thing a woman wants in a man, you know, is, is where he puts towels. That seems to be an obsession. <laughs> so you guys know about the towel thing. But I don't understand it. It's a sign. Oh, now I've, now I've become the woman in this relationship. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean It's now? not about the towel, Sean. <laughs> <laughs> Presents. Do you know what it says to me, Sean? You've got out of the shower and you thought, yeah, I'll let John get that towel. <laughs> what you know are you doing in my bathroom? <laughs> <laughs> Picking your towels up, that's what I'm doing, young man. If you shop from Amazon, I was, I was, I, I had a Kindle. I loved Kindle. I had loads of them. I liked them so much. <laughs> I had a whole bookshelf for Kindle. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> then I found out that Amazon don't pay any tax. And I had to get rid of all these Kindles I was giving away. I said, there's Pride and Prejudice. <laughs> Sean, have you ever embarrassed your partner? No, I think it's pretty to mind. It's incredible. For example, what, what's embarrassing? We've got a list here of embarrassing, what is embarrassing? embarrassing things. OK. Tripping over in public. Can you just trip over? That's not embarrassing. It's funny. How is it not embarrassing to trip over in the street? Why is that embarrassing? People trip over. Not everything's level. We don't live <laughs> on a snooker table. That's <laughs> <It's> unreasonable. <laughs> I, I had sex with a tramp recently. <laughs> I didn't have any change, and you can't just walk past and give them nothing. Can you? <laughs> I wouldn't drink the water around the X Factor. <laughs> I mean, they put something in the tea, and you can get the most hard hearted person who drink the tea and just go. <laughs> <laughs> I just saw a pigeon. <laughs> I used to work in, um, in a dog food factory. <laughs> and my job was to make sure the dog food really stank. <laughs> because, you know, when people... So that people don't confuse it with normal meat. So they put, you have to put this stuff in it. You know when you open a tin of dog food and you go, oh. <laughs> and I had to put this, this stink stuff, I used to mix it up, this stink stuff. And as it came past, I used to just put a bit in. And one day I mixed it up a bit too strong. And a lot of people complained the company was sued because it was so strong people were opening. And, uh, Snapping their necks. They were getting whiplash from dog food. <laughs> whiplash because I'd made it too stinky. <laughs> I put forward a Bond theme and they didn't go for it. <laughs> well, well, that's a shame. What was, what was yours? Bond on a bike. Bond on a boat. <laughs> Bond with his hands around a middle and throat. Skyfall! Skyfall! <laughs> Skyfall, Skyfall, da 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 da. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>
I think your view of magic and mine may be different. <laughs> I'm not sure whether that is magic. What is that? What is that? <laughs> that <was really> <laughs> I mean, I'm mesmerised. Thank God you got into comedy shows. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have my props with me. <laughs> what I do, if I have burglars, I've got a burglar's outfit by the bed. And I dress up in it. <laughs> And I go downstairs and I go, there's nothing up there. <laughs> oh, Jet, let's get out of here. He's got a big dog, he's a bit nuts. Let's get out of here. <laughs> I've only ever done one tweet. And it, I've got 36,000 followers. Which, if you worked it out on a follower per tweet ratio, <laughs> I'm the most successful person ever on Twitter. <laughs> <laughs> what did tweet. you tweet? I tweeted, due to a series of imposters, I have been forced to set up a Twitter account. Now go f yourself. <laughs> What's a rapper then? Rapper's just. Um... What's a rapper? <laughs> <laughs> What's a rapper then? <laughs> He's in his cardigan there. He's having a mug of tea good. I feel like to know. <laughs> Tell me about this rapping. <laughs> Most annoying thing about going to the cinema, what, what do you think? The films. <laughs> well, really, you had to expect the there films. to be films. They're all s. <laughs> <laughs> This old Cockney walking along in front of me, like this. Gonna be... <laughs> <laughs> and then he was building up to a sneeze, and he actually went, hey. Hey, hey. Hey, hey. And he went, hey, choo! <laughs> <laughs> know, that's, that's a Cockney sneeze. You couldn't put that up. No, no, you couldn't. That's a natural, that's a natural noise. My wife does a terrible thing, she doesn't give you any warning. Choo! <laughs> Well, no, uh, uh, nothing. No warning. Just sitting there. Damn! Ah! Oh, <laughs> I've been shot. Twenty-eight percent of people think the government is hiding evidence of aliens. You shouldn't even be saying that. <laughs> For Christ's sake, Jimmy, that stuff should be kept under wraps. <laughs> Listen, you the truth that? is out there. Doof, doof, doof. <laughs> Man, you can't put that sh out there and blow their f***ing minds. <laughs> yeah. They're not no. ready for it, Jimmy. I can't believe you said it. <laughs> <laughs> do, you know, do you know something I found out? That you know, when you buy ham in the supermarket in a packet, there's cameras in there. <laughs> you, you, look at the, you look at the hangar, oh, what's the sell by date on that? There's somebody watching you <laughs> in like a government office somewhere. <laughs> they're all just shocked. We're, we're, they're all going, going they're ones. all going, why isn't this on the news? Because <laughs> they won't let it out there. So that's, what, that's the sign of games they're playing with us. <laughs> Once you know that, the aliens thing doesn't seem so weird, then. No. <laughs> oh, we've got, apparently we've got a sound problem. Hang on one sec, what's the sound problem? We got well, one, obviously, that's, they're trying to shut us down, aren't they? <laughs> <laughs> no, you don't... Whose mic is it? It's, it's, it's Sean's mic. Well, Sean's you just saw it, it? Yeah. <laughs> 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 if this isn't proof of what I've been saying, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, let's shut Sean up. One of the things about Strick is they do the Paso Doble, the Cha Cha Cha, Foxtrot, but they don't do things the dances that people normally do, like just pub dances. <laughs> <laughs> right. And now <laughs> it's Lewis and Tatiana dancing to Chumba Wumba. They do it. You think true? What are you going to go for, Sean? Doesn't matter what we say; it'll all be covered up. <laughs> They'll change my words to say what they want me to say. <laughs> Melanie, you're the only person that seems to be yeah. sane on your team. Put that. what you want in there. Yeah. Put what you want in there. Don't say that. <laughs> sure. Put your life in there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Bloody beautiful, that is what you said there. That's beautiful. 